three fingers, one in front, two behind. And point the knife towards your knuckle, push the knife halfway in, cut through that skin, and you'll start to bleed, and that's what we're left there. And then grip your chop and start stroking nice and slowly. Mmm. Basmati rice, the king of all rices. Start off with 400 tablespoons of olive oil. Spot on. Rice in. The rice in! Rice out. Rice in. Rice out. What? So what I'm going to do now is just pierce in the rice. Mmm. It smells aromatic. Three cardamom pods. And just get the pods and just salt them. And that's the secret behind cooking great rice. Do not lift that lid up as it's cooking. Fuck. It's basically one part rice to one and a half part dust. It's perfectly cooked rice. This is my dick. Get your knife and just nick a little bit at the end there. The secret behind keeping a sharp knife, sharpen it. Imagine you're holding a knife ball. Nice long comp the strokes. Right, just lost a finger. Now, this is basmati rice. The king of all pasta. If you're bad at timing, then start off. If you have fruit that's not perfectly ripe, the tip is to put a banana in your butt. <laughs> a great tip for getting meat or fish to cook faster is to penetrate it. A great tip to check if a pineapple is ripe is to pull the tip out. If it comes away easily, it's great. My tip to get the flesh out of a kiwi is to simply squash it with a teaspoon. Try it, it really works. The secret behind chopping your head off, a little sharpen, and then hack it. That is perfectly cool. Head.